welcome back to Cooking with Greg Wong. We're a little casual, we have a little lunch cookout today. Uh, it's the weekend, so uh, we're just gonna hang out and do some cooking. Uh, so what I thought I'd show you today is a really nice little fish recipe, a steamed fish recipe. And you can use any white fish you'd like. Today we're using just a codfish, just a couple fillets. And what I'm gonna do is steam this with ginger, we're gonna put some soy sauce on there, and once it's done, we're gonna infuse it with hot oil. So you'll get a kick out of this. So the first thing I'm gonna do is, we're using two different woks today. I'm gonna to put this wok on here. I'm simply gonna put uh, some water in the wok and heat it up. I'll show you, we're gonna, we're gonna put about four ladle spoonfuls of water in here. And we'll bring that up to a, a boil. Now when we steam this fish, because of the system I'm using, uh, the Easy Walk with the uh, high heat burner, the X76 burner, it's not gonna take very long at all. Probably about, we won't wanna steam it more than two minutes. All right, that was pretty quick. So I'm gonna just dial this temperature down a little bit. Keep it boiling somewhat. We'll put our steamer in here, put the lid on there, and the first thing I'm gonna do is just uh, dress the uh, fish with some fresh julienne ginger. So we're gonna use a lot of ginger, because we like ginger. Lots of ginger, all right. So now we'll just put this in the steamer, our filleted codfish, with the julienne ginger, ginger root. So let's use a towel just in case. We'll set that baby right in here. Make sure she try to keep her level. Put our lid on it. So while this is steaming, just for about two minutes, you know one of the things I like to do with this style of cooking is because my time is limited. I work in the motion picture industry, so I work a lot of hours. On the weekends when I go out to the farmer's market, get all my produce and to the market for my meats, I, I then come home and I spend a couple hours and I prep all those foods for this style of cooking. Chop all my vegetables, put them in Ziplocs and or stay fresh containers, and then the meats I'll slice, dice, cube, however I want to prepare meats. And then I'll individually wrap two servings of the meats uh, in the Ziploc freezer bags and I'll freeze those so that on the day, I'll take out a pack of beef or chicken or fish or whatever I might be cooking that evening and put it in the cooler. So then when I come home, all I have to do is grab my plate, pick a few vegetables, grab my sauce tray, head out back and whip up something real easy. So also today we're using a new system which is available now for pre-order at thewonderwalk.com. It's called the Easy Walk Cook System. So we're good to go here. Now I'm gonna dial the temperature down. I'm gonna let it stay in the steamer here, but just set our wok up here. And we don't wanna melt our container there. And I'm gonna bring my second wok up here. And now I'm just gonna heat up just a quarter of a spoonful of oil. Just a little bit, something like that. And we're gonna heat that up slowly because we don't wanna burn it. Make sure your ladle's free from liquids. We can actually just gently circle this around here and heat this up. Now we wanna get this oil pretty hot, so. Okay, so now that our oil's nice and hot here, I'm gonna dial the temperature down. We'll set our utensil here. We're going to remove the lid. And there's our nice steamed fish. We'll take our soy sauce and we'll just dump that on the fish like that. And we'll take our Julian green onions and put that on here. And, and what I'm gonna use is this tablespoon and we're just gonna grab some of this sauce and put it on the fish. Make sure the fish is covered with this. 
sauce. Just like that. And now what I'm gonna do is take this hot oil and just take a little bit of this hot oil and put it right on this fish. Just a little bit more. Oh yeah, just like that. And we'll take our, our garnish, our cilantro around the plate, just a couple pieces of chopped cilantro on there. All right, now what I'm gonna do is take this out of the wok, and we'll actually grab this out. And we're gonna double plate this. And here you have your steamed ginger fish.